Hoda Kotb will co-anchor NBC's Today Show. Hoda Kotb was named co-anchor of the first two hours of NBC's venerable Today Morning Show, launching the program into a new era after the ouster of longtime co-host Matt Lauer for inappropriate behavior in the workplace. She will sit alongside Savannah Guthrie, making the NBC program at present the only national AM program anchored solely by a female team. Cott will continue to co-host the 10 a.m. hour of today alongside Kathy Lee Gifford, a role she has held since 2007, when she co-anchored the hour with Ann Curry and Natalie Morales. Kathy Lee Gifford, long known for co-hosting the syndicated Live with Regis Philbin, joined her at Today in 2008, and the two have led an unorthodox morning hour that involves drinking wine, interviewing celebrities and finishing each other's sentences. The program has proven popular enough that NBC for a time offered repeats of it during overnight hours. Over the past several weeks, Hoda has seamlessly stepped into the co-anchor role alongside Savannah, and the two have quickly hit the ground running. They have an undeniable connection with each other and most importantly, with viewers, a hallmark of today, said Andy Lack, chairman of NBC News Group, in a statement Monday morning. Hoda is in a word, remarkable. She has the rare ability to share authentic and heartfelt moments in even the most difficult news circumstances. It's a tribute to her wide range and her innate curiosity. Cobb is likely to continue doing what she has always done it today. Whether holding forth with the outspoken Gifford or lending a hand during the show's first two hours, Cobb has for months had a presence during that time, she tends to bring a sense of calm to the proceedings the show could use it. Lauer's departure, based on NBC News discovery that he had acted inappropriately with female colleagues, has raised fears today could be hurt in its perennial ratings race with its chief rival, ABC's Good Morning America. Like the other broadcast morning programs, today has lost viewers in the demographic advertisers like most, people between 25 and 54. The show also faces a changing field. Audiences are gravitating to AM programs that are less buttoned down, and thrive on hard news opens and tougher on-air interviews between anchors and politicians and newsmakers. Cobb has filled in as co-host on Today since Lauer was pushed out in late November. Since that time, the show's ratings have surged. Today has won more viewers overall and among the 25 to 54 crowd than GMA or CBS's CBS This Morning for four weeks. Its lead over GMA, however, has slipped and it is not clear whether the NBC show can maintain its new dominance. This has to be the most popular decision NBC News have ever made and I'm so thrilled, said Guthrie in the opening moments of Monday's program. The decision makes Guthrie in some ways the de facto leader of the program. A veteran political and legal correspondent, Guthrie has soldiered on in recent weeks, having to inform today audiences about the surprise ouster of Lauer and keep the show going under emotional duress. Savannah, in her five years co-anchoring today, has proven to be one of the best and most uncompromising interviewers in the business. Her unique credibility spans politics and pop culture and everything in between, said Lack. On top of all that, we've been lucky enough to watch in delight in her joy as she has built her own family, all while becoming the center of today's. She's been a rock for our organization in tough times, and we are grateful. But viewers have followed her personal life as well as her career achievements. They have watched as she detailed a battle with breast cancer in 2007 and they recently followed earlier this year when she adopted a daughter at age 52. They will no doubt continue to track the host in her new position.